How are you feeling? I'm a bit nervous. Oh god. Why are you being nervous? <sighs> if just you, if you believe you everything always works out for you, then what's the problem? I know you're right. But what's I the just don't want to get it wrong. I don't want to get it wrong. Rio, how are you feeling? Excited? You're clashing a bit with the orange <laughs> sofa, but that's okay. <laughs> Love you so much. Oh, how am I feeling? I am feeling excited. Cannot wait for Rio to be officially our baby um, in the eyes of the law, obviously. I mean, I can't wait actually for this never to happen again to anybody else. I truly believe it's so unnecessary and actually we could just be put on the birth certificate at birth with everyone saying yes. I feel like that should be the law, but things are gonna change, I'm sure, as time goes on. And I feel like we're the guinea pigs to this, but Let's make this happen today. This is a jive! Oh, We've just come off the thing. We've got dressed in pink. <laughs> and it didn't work. And it didn't work. Right, we're going to do blue next time. Oh my gosh. So they basically said they don't have Sam's forms, which we know they do have yeah. Sam's forms. And they need a DNA test because they won't accept the signed form from my doctor. Basically, if you're going to do surrogacy... Don't say it. <laughs> it's the only court that is this terrible. I know. They're, they're the worst. And they're, like, basically we had a different judge to last time, so it's like they've got different rules. Yeah. She was, she was like, oh, I don't normally allow kids in the court, but he seems to be well behaved. And I'm like, last time she was like, I don't see Rhea. I need to see Rhea. I do need to see the child. I'm like, oh my God. I need to call our lawyer. I just know it'd been more frustrating in all my life. I know, it is the most frustrating thing ever. Yeah, yeah, I can, yeah. So the new judge we had today said that she can't say yes because she doesn't have your form now. That's what I said to her. I said to her, like, there's no way that judge was so strict. There is absolutely no way that she would have said you're fine to not be on the call if she didn't have your forms. She's like, well, we don't have, we don't have them here, so I can't sign them off. And while she's at it, I, I need a DNA test. No other gay couple needs a DNA test. Yeah. Oh, I have never felt like this. For once I'm lost for words. Your smile has really thrown me. I'm just so grateful for another fantastic waste of half an hour. Oh, why, why do I have to go for that nerves again? <laughs> like, uh, Oh, this is just not funny at all. No, it's not funny. We honestly thought we'd be filming this to be like, yay, we got dressed in pink, hooray. I instructed a lawyer. We instructed Gosh. a lawyer. Right, I've got to go. Bye. So this is the third attempt at filming this vlog. Hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. I'm Francis. My husband Stuart is behind me. We're a little bit nervous today because we are about to get ready for our third court case for the process of Rio, our baby, officially becoming ours. Today's the day, like any other. Francis, I can tell by his breathing. Right, let me just ground you. Because Francis is a, is a big panicker, and so I really want to just ground you into the ground. You are an amazing dad. You deserve to be... We deserve to be Rio's legal parents. It's gonna happen. And if it doesn't, that's also fine because we've experienced two, ah. two bouts of rejection already. <laughs> I'm sure it's gonna be fine. You've what? done everything you could possibly do. So I think it's time for you to breathe into this moment. And again, breathe in. Whilst I'm breathing, do you wanna explain what's going on? So I'm basically grounding Francis because today is a very important day. We are about to receive the keys to the next part of our life, which basically means that we're gonna receive the parental, parental order. order 
which means that we're going to have our names on Rio's birth certificate. This is a piece of paper. But if the judge, if paper. the judge so decides. <laughs> The last How have we got here? Because couple of we experiences. Want to explain to them because we haven't actually posted any of the content that we filmed because it I never, don't. we never had a resolution. We never had the. Well, this that we might wanted. not even be posted. No. I'm like, well, that's if that's that, that's the case, and we're also too scared to post in case yeah. we were saying the wrong thing or coming from a place of frustration, which we were very frustrated, especially me, because I was just like, what is going on here? Like different rules for different people. So just give you a lowdown. We had this is our third hearing. So normally you just have one hearing. You present all your statements, your documents, and then the judge goes, great, I'm gonna grant you the parental order. The first hearing, we didn't have the statements and she hadn't had heard the report from the social worker. But she said, it's fine, we don't need the surrogate on the next call, I've got all the information from her. Yeah, she's given her consent, I don't need her to see her anymore. Second call, we had a different judge and she was like, I don't have the consent from the surrogate. And we were like, oh. oh. And in that time we hired a lawyer, because we were like, I don't understand legal language. And she wrote this most, the most extensive statements, which were apparently good. She was like, I need a DNA now test. Now I need a DNA test. To make sure, because this letter is not appropriate. This is not okay. It's like, well, it was for all the other gay couples. <sighs> kind of glad things have maybe gone wrong because it gives us more to talk about and more to understand and also a platform to maybe impact greater change. So I'm definitely not the, pleased that things went wrong though. <laughs> Just like, just let me have a. It was going right for us. What's going on? I know. I was like, this is different. It's just all really admin. It's not like, oh, uh, you're not being good parents. I have to check up on you again. It's more. It's just the admin that needs to be in front of the, uh, the judge for her to make the decision. So, do you want to show them? Like, this is our I'll do it all right. The thing for me. Can I say one more thing? Yeah, I'm gonna do one more thing, and now all right. Can I just say, just say all right. All rise! <laughs> this is my court outfit, it's probably not appropriate. The thing that, that really confused me in the, in the second hearing is that she said, right, we need to get a DNA test to make sure that one of you is the father. And we're like, great, but if that DNA test came back and it, we, it worked out that we weren't the father, what would happen to Rio? Like, <laughs> that's the question I had, yeah. it's like, okay, you're not the father, so, does Rio go into the system? Does Rio, like, what happens? We've got two people that actually want to have, to look after this child. And so it really confused me as to what would, what yeah. would be that situation if that wasn't the case? Luckily, obviously it is, but we, we know we did the right thing. But what would be the case? Anyway. We've got 10 minutes. We've got 10 minutes. Let's go and debrief. Francis, what I want you to do on this call. This is brief. This is brief. <laughs> You've got such a nice chest. Right, Rio's asleep. I, I, I can guarantee you he'll wake up at midday. <laughs> we hope we'll report back later, hopefully with amazing positive news, so we can actually post this vlog. So we'll see you in a minute. Bye. It's just so. <laughs> <laughs> Why are we crying? <laughs> <laughs> we were we both got so emotional at the end there. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> it just took so long. Oh my god. So she granted us the parental order, which we're very happy about. It's I know it's the process, and I know that's the way it has to go, but you always feel like you've done something wrong and we know obviously we've done something right, and it's just the way what we have to prove legally, but... Sam's calling. Sam's calling. <laughs> We're crying. Hi, honey. <laughs> that end was just so... so I couldn't stop crying. <laughs> I was trying not to have any emotion whatsoever, <laughs> but I literally couldn't stop crying. Oh God, ah. thank you so much. <laughs> she was just so strict again. I fucking hate how strict they all are. They're such bitches. I even mentioned that, well, she didn't actually say it, but. <laughs> uh, do you, you want to be here? You don't, don't need to be here. It's like, I 
it's like I can't quite make out your signatures if your signatures. I'm like, do you want to? Do you want to find something else to like? Oh my god, it's crazy. Oh, god. But she was nice at the end. Like what she said at the end was yeah. nice. She was nice. I don't. She's just been a a judge. Yeah, it's just a job for so many years. <laughs> um, why did why did we start crying? Like, oh. were you emotional? <laughs> She's like, I'm not. I'm not emotional. Why? I don't know why. I don't see Tom. I can only see him. <laughs> oh, I do feel emotional now. I've seen you. Though. Oh my oh, god. god! What a fucking oh, nightmare. Yes. What a process. It, it just was feels like, like the best journey ever but that last bit was not my vibe yeah it's basically when you weren't really involved it all seems to go wrong maybe it's you you were holding this all together (laughs) but congratulations on not being a parent anymore (laughs) oh my god two children back to having two children Craig how does it feel back to having two children (laughs) oh Oh, well, this show's the easiest. These two are <laughs> <laughs> isn't it? Finally. Thank you so much. Finally, thank you. I actually can't believe it. Like, what the hell? We've actually done it. <laughs> Feels like years ago. It does. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, are we still talking about this? <laughs> I thought he was going to pass out. At the no, point. I wasn't going to pass like, out. <laughs> I was like, calm the fuck you know, your down. Bra- your brain starts to go to other things. It's like, oh, uh, is she going to find something else about us? Or, do you know what I mean? It just goes wild. Um, but I know. Crazy. Well, at least we can celebrate now. We need to do something to celebrate yeah, in, in, in a party. really nice way. Not even a, par- not even a party, party. Just, just the, the, just the garden is enough. Yeah. Doing something nice together. Yeah. Yeah, sounds good. Good idea. Oh my goodness, I just love you guys. Um, congratulations. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. As you can tell my eye, by my eyes, I am totes emotional. It's just been such a process and it, this is just like the final bit of like it all being over and just that, just the legal side of things. I was saying to Stuart, it just feels like you're in the wrong rather than something that was so felt so right what she did say on the call though which i did understand is that yeah. she wants to do her job to make sure that there has been no wrongdoing yeah. because and people totally can that. be abused in these situations yeah. and actually after she said that i thought yeah. i would much prefer someone to be doing a good job yeah. and not being yeah. a woman not being abused for this yeah so yeah no i i totally get that it just it's just when, when it's your child and the love you feel, you know it's, he's yours, it's just like, to have to prove that is just not what the average person has to go through. But imagine fighting for your child. Uh-huh. That must be so hard. Anyway, we are, when Rio wakes up, we're gonna celebrate with him. <laughs> we're not gonna wake him up until then. I'm gonna go take a little lie down. <laughs> I'll be here in a bit. Officially, honey. Officially your dad. Mm. I'm officially your dad. (laughs) I'm officially your dad. Let's get you out of that so we can celebrate. You did so well to sleep all through it. Oh my gosh, I know. So good. (laughs) (laughs) Oh my gosh. Can you believe it? I'm officially, I'm legally your dad. I've always been officially your dad, but I'm legally your dad. <laughs> Are you happy? Let dad, let's, let daddy have a hug too. Oh, you're here. very warm. Here's your other official dad. I am official daddy. <laughs> oh. We cried at the end of the call. It was very emotional. 
<laughs> How does it feel to officially have two daddies? <laughs> you love it. He definitely he loves it. <laughs> Should we get downstairs and play? <laughs> <laughs>